Mission briefing. This mission is a request from Sky Union. The details are as follows. Hostile AI forces have invaded Sky Union's territory within the Ovalink. Each assigned mercenary must quickly clear out the enemies within the designated area. We have also confirmed that the invading enemy force consists of these seized AI. For this mission, the area has been divided among all participating reclaimers. You will be accompanying Bulletworks. Briefing over. Any questions, hit me up. I'd be happy to show you the ropes. So you're a vet now, Tony. <sighs> See what I gotta put up with? Come on, Corporal. When are you gonna stop treating me like a newbie? Four, send us the mission data. Uploading. That should be everything. Consult this data for detailed information about the mission area. Continue your approach. The mission will begin soon. Catch you later, rookie. Scanning battlefield. Femto particle density is low. Electronic devices will not be affected. Initiating each arsenal's data link. Opening squad communications channel. Begin the mission. Hey, Rookie. Looks like you made it to the battlefield in one piece. Welcome to the Oval Link! Exciting, isn't it? This is hell, Johnny. Encased in a 2,000-kilometer-wide barrier. Focus. Come on, man. What do you keep busting my chops for? Oh, I forgot to introduce myself. The name's Johnny G. I'm with Bulletworks. And that lovely ray of sunshine is the Corporal. He's with Bulletworks, too. Please remember to use my call sign, Falcon. My call sign is my real name. Man, I wish I had a cool sounding call sign like Falcon. A call sign is just a word to help us ID each other. If you say so, Corporal. Anyway, Bola Works has been placed in charge of this area. The other areas are being handled by other reclaimer squads. Choose your partners wisely. In this line of work, the wrong choice can get you killed. Corporal's right. You'll definitely want to steer clear of the shadier mercs. Just keep tabs on the mercenary rumor mill, and you'll learn fast who's hot and who's not. Anyway, back on top. Sky Union has managed to hold this area for a long time. But every now and then, AI invaders will show up knocking at the door, trying to get in. And when that happens, we get called in to clean house. Pest control, more or less. Pretty much. You probably already know about the Immortals, but just in case. They're responsible for corrupting all these AI that we've been sent to destroy. But, our arsenals are more than a match for them. These AI might as well be fish in a barrel. Immortals must be destroyed on sight. We'll get a bonus for each one we take out. Stay within the mission area. Four will alert you if you're about to stray. Just leave it to me. Also, sometimes on the battlefield, you can salvage equipment for your arsenal. Whatever you find, you keep. Try to recover any equipment you come across. If you're lucky, it'll be high quality stuff. But, most of the time, it's junk. I think that about covers everything. Clustering is a bad tactic, so spread out. If you need help, call for me or John. Over and out. Woohoo! Time to get this party started! Automatic return sequence. 
Return according to instructions. Over already, huh? Looks like the rookie's still in one piece, too. Time to head home and... Wait, Johnny. I don't like how this smells. Something's coming. You and your nose. Access granted. Sky Union's radar station has confirmed the appearance of immortals in your vicinity. Transmitting target data. has notified us of a change to this mission. You are to stop these immortals from advancing further into Sky Union's territory. What? You've got to be kidding me! What's the call, Corporal? We're right where we need to be. Should have known you'd say something like that. Ah, fine. I guess we're doing this. There are no whiners in bullet books. Besides, I'm sure BG planned for this. I really hope you're right about that. Gale, what are you talking about? Still alive, huh? You've gotten stronger, it seems. Corporal! Johnny G! Get out of the way! Major! Lieutenant! Falcon, Johnny G. We'll take it from here. Follow my lead. I won't always have your back, you know. Focus on defeating these for now. Fine, but someday you'll be next. That's the spot. <laughs> Mission complete. Mission accomplishment recognized. Initiating return sequence. I see we have a new face with us. Let me introduce myself. I'm Crimson Lord, second in command of Bulletworks. And this is Diablo. You did well out there. I'll be sure to keep you in mind. Whew, what an ordeal. I just wanted to score some quick credits. Good thing those two swooped in to save us. We're still alive. That's all that matters. You really got to work on your praise, Corporal. Until next time. I will provide all necessary information for completing future missions. Is there anything you'd like to ask me? Immortals are a new form of life. That much is certain. After the moon fell, 
an unknown phenomenon caused some AIs to regard humanity as a threat that must be annihilated. These immortals have their own unique language, as well as individual personalities. They can also corrupt other AIs and human weapon systems, assimilating them into their ranks to bolster their forces. Working alongside the consortiums, our goal at Orbital is to control all areas in the Oval Link. Missions to eliminate immortals are assigned to mercenaries like you to achieve that goal. Your individual ability has the greatest impact on your arsenal's power, but new weapons and equipment are just as important. You can also have experimental weaponry loaned to you by building your reputation with specific consortiums. Building your service record through repeated battles is the fastest way to becoming as strong as Crimson Lord and Diablo. Your reward payout is higher than usual this time because your mission objective was updated from its original listing. There is precedent for requesting higher payouts, but I do not recommend it, as it can leave an unfavorable impression with the client. Mission briefing. Briefing will now commence. This mission is a request from Sky Union. In response to the appearance of Gigant class immortals during the previous mission, Sky Union has deemed it necessary to investigate neutral areas to prevent future immortal invasions. I've uploaded a map of the mission area. The area you'll be investigating shares a border with Sky Union's territory. Complete any necessary preparations, then stand by and await dispatch. Briefing over. Gigant class immortals. So named after the mythological race. Colossal beings born from the blood that fell when the primordial god Uranus was castrated. One could say that in this gigantomachy of our time, we are like unto Zeus, brandishing his mighty thunderbolt. Real wordsmith, this guy. Say, I heard you were the first to face off against one of these. What was it like? <laughs> you got guts, rookie. Can't wait to see you in action. Sorry you gotta put up with the prince here, though. Hmm? Did you call me Prince just now? Lots of people call you that. House Valentine does not exactly constitute a royal family. I suppose in this age that distinction is lost on common folk. Very well, I will allow you to continue to address me as such. Gee, how considerate of you. In any event, it is essential that every last immortal be driven out. They are a blight to be purged by humanity. Uh, can I ask a question? Go ahead. Oh, you're that straight shooter from Innocence. Have you been here the whole time? I have. I'm actually responsible for gathering information for our team. Please ask your question. Yes, right. The information we have on those Gigant-class immortals indicates that conventional weapons are ineffective. So what do we do if we encounter one? In the previous encounter, the area's wide-range radar and communications tower were destroyed. We gathered what little information we could from the battle data of the Arsenal combatants. Beyond that, we know little else. Since Bulletworks was responsible for their destruction in the last encounter, it is highly unlikely that a similar type of immortal could be hiding nearby. Highly unlikely, but not impossible either. Precisely. Which is why Sky Union is loaning special weapons to those who accept this mission. Testing those weapons is a secondary purpose of the mission. Ah, a secondary purpose. I see. So there's a chance these untested weapons might work. But they're just loaning them to us? Yeah, I'm gonna need more incentive than that, especially when there's a chance these weapons are total duds. 
What, we just gotta assume all the risk and that's that? They can't sweeten the deal at all? Come on, work with me here. I'll see what I can do. One moment, please. Holding out for a greater reward. You disappoint me, hero. Your older brother would never engage in such unbecoming conduct. Okay, I admit it. Dev is more of a hero than I am. He's all about getting up close and using his own power to take down enemies. But me? Well, if someone's gonna give me a powerful new weapon to play with, I am not gonna say no to that. Impressive. Yes. As mercenaries, we answer to a higher call. One that demands we destroy the Immortals by any and all means at our disposal. Such is our burden as agents of justice. I imagine being rich enough to afford a made-to-order arsenal helps to ease that burden, though. My siblings and I, we have to work hard so we can afford to eat. It'd really help if you sat this one out, Savior. What do you say? I wish you good luck. If you fight as a stalwart agent of justice, I will not need to enter the fray. That, in turn, would entitle you to my share of the reward. Deal. I'll do my part. I have completed negotiations with Sky Union. They are willing to extend the loan period indefinitely if you agree to provide them with all future battle data. Well, in that case, I accept this mission. What about you, Prince? When duty beckons, ours is not to refuse. Innocence will also accept. Scanning battlefield. Femto particle density is uneven, but short-range radar will not be affected. Initiating each arsenal's data link. Opening squad communications channel. Begin the mission. If you really want to stop us, you gotta go all out. <clears throat> Move out. Don't let them swarm you. They're weak one-on-one, -on -one, but in a group, they're a real pain to deal with. Rookie, try using those missiles of yours. The displayed number is your locked on targets. You can fire more missiles with each target you acquire. Oh, so you're the little rookie I've been hearing about. <laughs> you look more broken in than I expected. Name's Deva of the Steel Knights. What's up? All right, knock it off. I met the rookie at the briefing. Prince and no-nonsense notes are off handling another area. Don't worry, rookie. I'm sure you'll team up with them eventually. Prince? That tool savior's still alive? One of these days, I really need to knock him off that high horse of his. If you did, I doubt he'd notice. I barely remember we even exist. Truth. Oh, whoops. We gotta make sure to keep the rookie here in the loop. Now, we mercenaries usually form groups to do this work. Collectively, we're known as Reclaimers. As a group, it's easier to take on bigger missions and negotiate for whatever supplies we'll need. If you don't want to die, surrounding yourself with allies is the way to go. You teamed up with Bullet Works before, yeah? Among Reclaimers, they're one of the larger groups. All former military types, experts in the art of war. We're talking the best of the best of the best among Reclaimers, no question. And that Prince guy? He actually leads a group of Reclaimers called the Five Hells. My crew is something else, that's for sure. They're nobles, basically. They got the credits and clout to put average Joes like us to work for them. That's one way of putting it. Still, even nobles have duties they can't shirk by paying off the masses. Well, whatever. We're all mercenaries in the Oval Link. And, as much as I hate to admit it, that guy's a good mercenary. Damn good, even. I bet you'd give him a run for his money in a fight. You're no slouch, either. Don't forget why we're the Steel Knights. Obviously. Me and my little brother Zoa are the only reclaimers in the Steel Knights. A two-man group like ours might seem odd, but that's just how we like to roll. The best way to learn about the more famous reclaimers is to check them out for yourself. Some of them are crazy. Just absolute nutcases who dive into this mess without even blinking. It's a real freak show, that's for sure. Anyway, all reclaimers receive missions from Orbital and the Consortiums. 
We complete those missions and get paid. That's all there is to it. But we all got our own reasons for doing this. Just check us all out, like Zoa said, and draw your own opinions. At the end of the day, we're all just mercenaries, fighting to survive. Now let's get to work. About time. If you find any big boys, let us know. Later, rookie. One bogey. Next. Sufficient weapon data collected. Mission accomplishment recognized. Executing automatic return sequence. Return according to instructions. Guess we didn't find any big boys. Talk about a tease. <laughs> but hey, at least we get to use these weapons all we want. I'd say that counts for something. I guess. Later, rookie. Don't go dying now. Mission briefing. If you have any questions, you can access me at any time to review the contents of this briefing. Briefing will now commence. This is a private mission from Zen. Whether you accept or refuse this mission, please be advised that severe penalties will be imposed if its contents are disclosed to others. Your objective is to investigate the border of Sky Union's territory and eliminate enemy AIs in the area. Additionally, Sky Union's territory may be included in the combat zone. As a precautionary measure to prevent a worst-case scenario, you are prohibited from bringing weapons on this mission. Complete any necessary preparations, then stand by and await dispatch. Briefing over. There, Baldy. You're gonna break the briefing terminal. Baldy! A big bad gargantua twerp! I don't need no details! Let me get to wrecking already! Bet you weren't expecting that, huh, rookie? Anyway, I'm Chill from Innocence. Nice to meet ya. And this loudmouth is with the Western Seven. His name is Big Bald. Uh. Hey, what was your name again? Big bad gargantua! Quit saying I'm bald! I'm only 24! I just shaved my head is all! Really? That looks a choice. You wanna die, twerp? This is a private mission to investigate the border of another consortium's territory. Seems sketchy, don't you think? We can't leave any trace of our presence either. That means we gotta procure weapons on site. Big deal! I'm just gonna wreck everything I see! Even you two! Stay out of my way or I'll wreck you up! <sighs> the Western Seven are all like him, pretty much. Anyway, 
See you out there, rookie. Scanning battlefield. Femto particle density is high. Long range radar is not available, but short range radar is not affected. Initiating each arsenal's data link. Opening squad communications channel. So no matter what we do, they can't see us from there. That is correct. Procure weapons for yourselves before you arrive at the designated area. Begin the mission. I do what I want! You two can kick rocks for all I care! <sighs> and off he goes. Well, rookie, I guess we better get started. I know we got dispatched empty-handed, but all arsenals have universal weapon specs. Meaning, if an enemy's using a weapon, we can use it too. You can either pick them off destroyed enemies or grab whatever weapons you find laying around. Scan complete. Displaying available weapons on your console. See? four has got our backs. Just pick up a weapon and she'll handle the calibration and configuration and whatnot. <laughs> Mission complete. Mission accomplishment recognized. 
Initiating return sequence. Nah, it's fine. We survived and that's all that matters. Let's go home, Ricky. Mission briefing. If you have any questions, you can access me at any time to review the contents of this briefing. Briefing will now commence. This mission is a request from Zen. Corrupted AIs have been confirmed at production facilities in Zen's territory within the Oval Link. Your objective is to destroy these facilities. Complete any necessary preparations, then stand by and await dispatch. Briefing over. about I just wish everyone would die well I just love breaking stuff I am so excited destroying facilities sounds way more fun than fighting little baby bots I bet Zin's none too happy about immortals corrupting facilities in their own territory still it's not like the built-in artificial intelligence and their drones can do anything to stop it from happening. Abyss and I will break you if your feeble old man brain gets corrupted. Won't be necessary. After all, immortals can't corrupt human minds. That's why outers like us make perfect mercs. Know what I mean? Maybe you would be better off dead. We certainly are. Better off dead, huh? Just don't bust up my cybernetic legs then. They're a custom job, one of a kind, very expensive. So you're the rookie everyone's talking up. Johnny already filled me in. I'm with Bulletworks, just call me Painkiller. And these two are... Heaven of the Five Hells! Abyss. You heard of the Five Hells? Their leader is this real high society type reclaimer named Savior. These young ladies are his little sisters. If that worries you, I get it. Believe me, I do. But I promise you, they're talented outers. We're way stronger than you, old man. She's not joking. Battlefield partners can be a crapshoot, but these two are trustworthy mercs. Anyway, I gotta get my arsenal ready. See you out there. Ciao! Kill you later. Scanning battlefield. Femto particle density in this area is low. Short range radar will not be affected. Initiating each arsenal's data link. Opening squad communications channel. Good to see you again. I'm counting on you. Abyss had something else to take care of. So, what are we playing today? 
Destroy the facilities corrupted by the Immortals. That's it! Non-stop production of corrupted AIs in Consortium territory. This could be bad PR for Zin. So what am I allowed to break? You can go off the chain, but do you remember what Savior said? Uh-huh, I totally remember. Uh, I'll get dinged for shooting allies, and I should always listen to four. That a girl. <laughs> Praise. You're a nice old man. When I break you, I'll make sure it doesn't hurt at all. Gee, thanks. I'm detecting numerous enemy AIs near the affected facilities. Caution is advised. Guess we're not gonna make this easy. Take down the AIs defending the facilities first. Let's roll! Yippee! Time to deliver justice! Woohoo! Justice planned. No complications. Initiating return sequence. We're done already? But I want to break more stuff. We gotta head back so you can tell Savior what a good job you did. That's right. Do you think my Lord Brother will praise me? <laughs> I'm sure he will. Speaking of which, good job, Rookie. Yeah.
Mission briefing. Briefing will now commence. This mission is a request from Orbital. A group of corrupted AIs have invaded the neutral zone under Orbital supervision. Work with the other reclaimers to defeat the invaders. You do not need to defeat all the AIs for this mission. The objective is only to defeat a certain number of them and slow their invasion. This mission will be closed when the maximum number of participants have joined. If you wish to participate, please apply immediately. Complete any necessary preparations, then stand by and await dispatch. Briefing over. Scanning battlefield. Femto particle density is low. Short range radar will not be affected. Eliminate as many AIs as you can within the mission area, but no fewer than the minimum required. Your reward will be determined by the total number of AIs you eliminate.
Mission complete. Mission accomplishment recognized. Mapping return sequence. Mission briefing. Briefing will now commence. This mission is a request from Sky Union. A group of corrupted AIs have invaded Sky Union's territory. An operation has been prepared to destroy them at the ruins of Aquaphor before they reach the city. This mission is an invitation to join the operation. During the mission, it is possible to collapse the decks along the AI's invasion path to destroy them. Destroy the decks and eliminate the remaining AIs. Complete any necessary preparations, then stand by and await dispatch. Briefing over. Approach complete. You have arrived at the mission area. Scanning battlefield. Femto particle density is low. Short-range radar will not be effective. Begin the mission. Detecting invading AI force. You can eliminate greater numbers of AI invaders by destroying the deaths. If done properly, this will allow you to conserve ammo while you fight. Mission briefing. Briefing will now commence. This mission is a request from Zen. Enemy AI forces have invaded Zen's territory within the Oval Link. Your mission is to destroy all enemy AIs in the area. This area borders Sky Union's territory, and Sky Union appears to be responding to enemy AIs on their side. Be advised that Sky Union may decide to intervene in this mission. Complete any necessary preparations, then stand by and await dispatch. Briefing over. Is it just me, or does the reward for this mission seem higher than normal? Hmm... Seems a little fishy. I get where you're coming from, Zoa. But maybe we shouldn't overthink this too much. I know eliminating immortals and enemy AIs will make the world safer, but a reward that high seems like a big red flag. I just want more battles under my belt. Besides, Chill, aren't you and your siblings in a tough spot right now? Financially, I mean. I heard Rigid got busted up pretty bad the other day. I swear, you immortal innocence kids just refuse to die. No, though not for lack of trying. Y yeah, well... Uh... I don't get how mission rewards and arsenal repair costs are balanced out. I thought being a mercenary meant we'd earn enough not to be broke all the time. Well, your crew is bigger than most. Mine's just me and my brother. Keeps things nice and simple. Don't let any of this nervous talk get to you, rookie. Unless something goes horribly wrong, this mission should be a cinch. What he said. Anyway, I gotta go. I don't know. I don't know about this. 
but there's no way I can turn down this mission. Still, be careful out there, rookie. Scanning battlefield. Femto particle density is low. Short range radar will not be affected. Initiating each arsenal's data link. Opening squad communications channel. Us two again, eh, rookie? I'm not really feeling this mission, actually, so you take the lead. You whistling out on me, Johnny? How are you gonna call yourself a man when you're too scared to fire a shot? Jeez, Drake. Cut me a little slack, will ya? I'm just being cautious, is all. I've been on enough battlefields to know this one is a joke. Besides, BG knows you've got what it takes. He does? But my call sign is still my real name. I feel like he hasn't given me a real call sign because he expects me to die soon. All the more reason to become the best merc ever and stick it to him. Oh, guess I better introduce myself. I'm Drake from Bulletworks. Johnny's superior, basically. She's amazing. Drake here served in Sky Union's army. She's a real lean, mean fighting machine. Don't listen to Johnny. A consortium's army ain't something to brag about. There's no reason to even have an army outside the Overlink. Unless you want to point your gun at refugees. But that never did sit right with me. Which led to you getting discharged for putting 20 soldiers in the infirmary. Like I said, you're amazing. Just take the compliment. Hey, enough chit-chat. We're mercs. We get paid to shoot, not talk. You better be careful around her, rookie. Or you'll end up number 21. Let's go. Where the hell are all these AIs coming from? We haven't even put a dent in them. Processing. New units have emerged from the territorial boundary. New units? We talking AIs or immortals? ID signals confirmed. Neither. Neither? What does that mean? Arsenals! Hey! Are you guys reinforcements? Johnny, they're coming in too hot! Amateur move. Always keep a stone-cold poker face before you pick up a face-down card. The Western Seven. Why did you attack Johnny? <laughs> because my console has you three flagged as enemies. Unless that's an error. Look out for the other one! <laughs> Brother, let me get in on the fun, too! Only two cards remain in this hand. One of those cards is the Bullet Works Philly, but the other is still face down. Red, are you man enough to pick up that last card? You bet! Just say the word and I'm on it! It's those Psycho Twins from the Western Seven. Johnny, you okay? If you can move, get out of here! Processing. Enemy AIs are gathering. Continue the mission. I'm not leaving you or the rookie behind. As long as my arsenal can still move, I'm gonna fight! Impressive, boy. Now that I know you can take a hit, I don't need to hold back. Excuse me? It's always exciting whenever a new player joins the table. This is going to be a fun game. <laughs> we can't leave till we've dealt with the AIs, but these lunatics aren't gonna make it easy. Rookie! Johnny, follow me! If we're playing tag now, then I'll just kill you all one at a time. There! Gotcha! Damn! They were trying to cut us off from the rookie the whole time! Four, do something! Assessing potential countermeasures. Too little, too late. 
I thought they'd provide more entertainment than this. Oh well. Brother, how many years do you think we'll get shaved off our sentence for killing this one? <laughs> if you really want to know, Red, just flip the card. And you'll have the answer. But what about you? Not interested. This one's all you. Then I'm gonna dig in! Accepted. Orbital has authorized the use of Mirage. Limiter release. Mirage? Against burst and arsenals? That's not gonna do check! Just do it, rookie! Take him down! use of Mirage and you've already mastered it. Interesting. Very interesting. Brother! Brother! Find your own way home, Red. If you survive, we'll play another game together. I hope you'll all join us. So long. Ah, Mission complete. Mission accomplishment recognized. Initiating return sequence. Oh boy. We're finished? I can't believe I'm still alive. You can thank the rookie for that. True. But my first key in class encounter also happened when I was with the rookie. Could be bad luck is all I'm saying. Good luck, bad luck. As long as you're still alive, that's a win. Let's head back while we still can. Um, Drake? What do you want to do about the little brother? He'll die if we just leave him here. Fine. Four, get a rescue to come help that wrecked idiot. Affirmative. I will issue a request to Sky Union through Orbital. Thanks, Drake. Don't thank me. BG would have done the same thing. Anyway, I'm glad we survived. But things are gonna get crazy when we get back. You might be summoned before an orbital committee, rookie. Hell, all three of us might be summoned. That's future Johnny's problem. Right now, I just want to go home and take a nice hot shower till I feel alive again. Hmm, I could go for that myself. Let's head on home. Yes, ma'am. Jeez, this was a long day. Rookie, got a sec? There's something I want to talk to you about. Well, not me specifically. I'm the leader of Bulletworks. Everyone calls me BG, or Brigadier General. We can forego any formalities. They, along with your character and heritage, amount to little here. All that truly matters is your service on the battlefield. I told BG all about you. I also looked into your service record. Don't blame Johnny. I asked them to do that. It's why I want to talk to you, actually. Should I leave? No. I want you to hear this too, Johnny. I've already informed Drake, but Orbital, Zen, and Sky Union have decided to erase all records of your last mission. What? I erase? W what about our reward? We still got paid, didn't we? You don't need to worry about that. Not a word of this to anyone, understand? If you say so, BG. But what about the rookie here? They almost died on that mission. On the battlefield, death is a constant companion. That's true of every mission, not just this one. I mean, sure, but still. I understand how you feel, but just let me take care of this matter. Once I know more, I'll let you both know. Right now, I've said all I can. Yes, sir. Understood. I... 
We trust you, BG. By the way, Johnny, I heard you and the rookie rescued the mercenary who tried to kill you. Why? Oh, well, how should I put this? The Immortals are our enemies, not other mercs. Killing that guy won't get us any closer to saving the world. At least, that's what I think. I see. Um, BG? It's up to me to ensure that young people like yourself survive into the future. If you'll excuse me, I have some other business to attend to. Whew, that was intense. I've never seen BG talk that much. He tends to be a man of few words. Well, anyway, that's that. Man, we had one hell of a day today. I'm sure BG knows what he's doing. Anyway, I'm gonna go catch some Z's. Catch you later, rookie. I definitely owe you for today. So no die until I paid you back. Got it? The existence of potential. The potential of existence. Words unravel, becoming threads once more. Threads comprising life itself. The world itself. The pattern woven by these threads. Has it emerged? Can you see it? Indeed, that is life. All these threads entwine with one's own. We are the same, and yet you are not me. Let's begin.